Welcome to our channel, Retired and Loving It. Give us a like, a share, and subscribe to our channel. We are so thrilled that you are joining us again today. Man, this shows how truly motivated and serious that you are in learning as much information and knowledge on retirement. Well, my name is Keith. I have 38 years experience as a senior accountant. And today we are coming to you from our home again here in Corridon, Indiana. And we are so thrilled that today we're gonna to be able to give you two more super retirement tips. And I'm Terry. I'm a credentialed minister, a certified life coach. Together we have 38 years ministry experience. And behind us is our mascot, Mr. Jingles. Rumor has it, next time we may be on location outside of our home. Yes. Today, we have traveled to our family room, looking into our kitchen. Well, let's get right into the retirement tips today. In the past, now we shared four videos with eight great retirement tips. If you missed them, go back and watch those videos and see what those eight retirement tips are. Okay, the first retirement tip today is that you need to fully fund your emergency fund. If there is one thing that we have learned yes. in our almost 45 yeah, years 45 of years, marriage wow. is that things can and will happen yes. that you don't expect. Mm. Your car will break down. Yes. Your washer will quit. Boy. Your home will need some major repair. The list goes on. Something will happen that you don't expect. So that's why it's so important that we take some portion of each paycheck and put it aside into an emergency fund so that when these unexpected things happen, we're prepared. You know, in this corona craziness that it's we're terrible. in right now, a lot of people have been furloughed from their jobs mm -hmm. and unemployment doesn't seem to be coming in very quickly. So, I mean, there's a lot of people who are genuinely hurting right now. And if you aren't prepared, you could really be in a bad spot. So, especially in times like these, we wanna be prepared, not only so that our needs can be met, but so that we can then help others. Yeah. With their needs. That's awesome. Now this goes right hand in hand with our second retirement tip and that tip is that you need to have different levels of savings. That's correct. If you listen to Dave Ramsey at all, the first thing he tells us to do is to get a thousand dollars put aside for emergencies. Now, Christmas, birthdays, we know those are coming. Unexpected. Those are not emergencies. Emergencies are something that happens that you do not expect yeah. if you lose your job or you get sick and can't work. So very important to first, that your first goal is to get that thousand dollars put aside. Mm -hmm. Then, once you get that thousand dollars put aside, you can start working on building your emergency fund to get it to where you have at least three months of expenses put aside. Now I know that sounds daunting. Yeah. It sounds like how in this world, but it's <clears throat> little by little. How do you eat an elephant? One bite at a time. So every paycheck, you put a little, even if it's $5, you put a little into your emergency fund. You will be amazed how fast it does grow. And then, so you have, we need a short-term savings. That's our emergency fund, where we can get to it if we need to, we've lost our job or whatever. And then we need a long-term savings, and this is our retirement. 
this is money that we put aside that we do not touch until retirement age. And if you dip into it early, you really lose big because mm -hmm. then you get to retirement age and you don't have what you need. So what you need to do is every paycheck, and this is a great time to do it, to yes. sit down and plan. If you fail to plan, you plan to fail. We don't want to fail. No. So let's plan. Let's decide how much of each paycheck is going to go into our emergency fund, mm -hmm. how much of each paycheck is going to go into our retirement, and where are you going to put this money? Because you don't want to put it somewhere where you're going to spend it. So plan. Let's get a plan together. Yes. And if you, we have shared several tips over the last several videos yeah. that are good money management tips and good tips to help us get prepared for retirement. And if you missed any of those, I'm gonna post a link to the playlist in the comments below. So just scroll down in the comments, find the link and watch those videos. We've been around the block a few times. We've learned a few things yes. and we're doing this to help others mm -hmm. because you know, you can learn through our experience. So get to planning. Before we leave you today, I want to encourage you that these might seem very overwhelming, but we've done it in our lives and I know that you can. You're motivated, you're watching these videos so that I know that you can do this. Well, thank you again so much for joining us today. Man, please give us a thumbs up, you know, press the like button down there. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel. And there's a little bell down there. If you click on that bell, every time we do one of these videos, whether it be here in our home, on location, you get notified about the video, and then you can start watching them too. So last but not least, is we want you to share these videos with your coworkers, share them with your friends, Man, your, your children and grandchildren, we want all of them to be able to retire as early as possible so they can start planning for retirement and then when they do retire, they can enjoy it. Thank you guys so much again for joining us. You guys are awesome. Please stay healthy. And you don't want to miss next time. Oh man. Because we're going to be, be awesome. on location. Yes, yes, yes. Outside of our home. Woo. So join us next time for Retired and, and loving, loving it. it.